We join the Super Legit crew before the show as we discuss some disk space issues our guest is having that definitely won't impact anything later. Does that mean for the recording, though? Like, it's not stored on that computer. It is, actually, yeah. So the way you, the way StreamYard works is both it's streaming and being recorded into a video mm. as well as each individual track is being recorded locally on your machine and then uploading in the background to the, oh. the streaming platform. And then when it's done, it finishes, and then that's what we download. That's super rad. Yeah, it's a great service. There's yeah, a few I, that operate like this now, but yeah. I was really nervous uh, at the start. I, I don't know if Josh shared the message to to you or anyone else but uh one of the first things i said was i'm not that good an audio recorder i don't know if i can get this off on my own yeah but i'm gonna try my best here that's the beauty of this platform we yeah can even we we haven't yet because we don't want to because of the quality but we can even do it on mobile this this service oh. supports phones and ipads oh, wow. and stuff that's yeah. super cool so yeah so like if you know if we have like Patton Oswalt or something. It's a bad example because mm -hmm. he's tech savvy. But like if we had someone at that level who was like, I don't know how to use this stuff. And we're like, that's fine. You're more important to have on the show than you have great sound quality. Mm -hmm. Then we could do it. I love that you pick the one celebrity who like can certainly navigate any yep. kind of web platform. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> pick a better guest like Steve Wozniak or somebody. Yeah. Right, right. Yeah. Some, somebody who's never touched a yeah, computer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. And not to uh, really like throw you off, Patton, but we're going to get really nerdy and talk about like D&D yeah. and fucking Star yeah. Wars and stuff. <laughs> going to do some Marvel yeah, stuff. Yeah. yeah. Have you ever seen this Ghostbusters movie? <laughs> Super Legit Podcast, everyone. I am your host, Jet Kaufman, and let's get right into the cast. It's a nice tight one this week. This is going to be fun. We've uh, we've got Chris Sanders. Always tight. <laughs> got Chris Compton. Cut. And we have our co-host, Michael Hyman. Hello, Michael. Hello, Jet. Um, wow, we are majority, almost a majority Chris's. Yes, There's yes, almost, almost. We, we've been slowly eliminating other cast members to get there. <laughs> Not a fan. I'll be honest. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, well, we'll work on it. I mean, we we could end up going with all curses. That's an op option. It's true. Fire myself. Yeah. Change, that's legally just change the current names. state of Hollywood. Yes. Right. Yes. It's yeah, that's true. true. Yes. We oh. we reflect. Yeah. Yeah. We're trying to be cool. I get it. <laughs> now I'm on board. You Always call me trying. Chris now. <laughs> Always trying. Uh. So uh. So who's our guest for this week, Michael Heim? Because it's not just the four of us. Jet. Our guest. Yes. His name. And he's here. Is Winston Andrews. He is an improviser, coach, and writer. Mm. Winston's genre mashup team Spec Script has performed all over the American Southwest and still reigns as the Orange County Improv Cage Match Champions for the past Ooh. four years. And you can hear him right now on the Super Legit Podcast. Welcome, Winston. Hello. 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 Where is the nice cage? The cage? <laughs> uh, well, <laughs> the, the trick is- You get to take it, it home is... with you? I, I get to like keep belt? the belt. Yeah. I kept the belt, right. um, but I, I don't think the show runs anymore. So we are still the reigning ones until uh, they start that show up again. Uh, we will re remain reigning. And every <sighs> <laughs> every once in a while, I'll show up the belt. Uh, uh, but yeah, uh, it, I, it's a totally legitimate title that I will keep. <laughs> uh, but one of the few actual accomplishments I have in improv. In, so on my it. on my non acting resume, uh, I, I for for like seven years I worked for Epson selling Epson printers in a Best Buy of all interesting jobs, and our our title was Weekend Warrior, which just sounds insane for a guy who sells printers. But that's what we were. We were Weekend Warriors, and they had a Weekend Warrior of the Month. There was also one of the year, that's, and these that's were both fucking stolen valor. Right. Right. Yeah. That is true. Right. Right. That is absolutely. true. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. We're listed um, as combat veterans. Right. Yeah. Uh, that's, it. that's it. But one 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 month I won Weekend Warrior of the Month. And then for the next three months they forgot to pick anyone else. So my name just stayed on the website. So my resume says I was Weekend Warrior of the Month for four months straight and Longest no one can say otherwise. Weekend Warrior yes. of all time. That's, it, bud. that's right. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, I'll take it. Very nice. <laughs> have the sixty percent disability rating through the VA. Mm, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. yeah if, to be fair, you know, we may not have been in the military, but we did have terrible health care. 
So like it does kind of kind of yep. equal out. Yep, yep, exactly. Uh, exactly. Uh so Michael Hyman, what's our what's our question for this week? Oh, Jet. This week's question, which uh came out of uh thin air, uh is if oh, this you... one came from uh, Jillian Bellinger, actually. Oh, did it? I'd love to know yes. that before sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> but that, <laughs> that's I great. I gave you that info. Thank you, Jillian, uh, for submitting this question for us. Uh, and here it is. It is. If you were able to see the all the other alternate realities, which Ooh. version of you would be most surprising? Ooh. So interesting. being able to see all other alternate realities and accepting that there are infinite realities out there so which any possibility which possibility which is the thing that is most surprising for you yeah well well said, Michael the Hyman. Infinite well universe. Said. i was just saying because josh isn't here uh i'm yeah. gonna take this moment to needlessly litigate the question someone has <laughs> um, to thank you chris uh, thank you, so do, are we saying like so this is this like a sliding doors like I made a different choice in this moment, uh, like like for example, referencing a movie from thirty years ago. That <laughs> um, it still plays. Um, I think uh, the only yeah. reason that yep. movie works is because of the concept. Now, oh, that's, mm-hmm. nobody has yes. seen Sliding Doors, right. but everybody right. knows reference Sliding Doors. Uh, I've never that, seen it, yeah. yet I'm infinitely familiar with the concept. <laughs> right. Wait, yeah. that's it's, a it's movie. A, it's a Darmark oh. and Jalad at Tanagra yeah. moment, where it's like we can all reference it, but no one knows where it came from. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, that thing. Uh, yes, <laughs> it's, a star, it's a Star Trek. Um, thing. But a like, quarter of our audience got it. Is it, is this the idea Did that, that like <laughs> where I would be if I had made one like a specific choice differently, or or just me like a different version of me that I can I can envision somehow? I like the fine tuning of that because as it is uh, written, it's like, hey, which thing in an infinite possibility would surprise you the most? And it'd be like, yeah. well, I guess the most surprising one. Unless you can really dig in and decide what would be most surprising for you personally in an infinite possibilities. But I, yeah, I the, like the, the Black doors. Mirror version is yeah. getting yeah. And can I also like, just yeah. say how much I love uh, Michael Hyman, how much you're stepping up and, and like getting into the weeds of uh, of the question? Because like, like, that used to be my thing. And I'm like, I am happy to sit back right now. I am tired. And you can just you can run this train. <laughs> oh, you're welcome. I already have a headache. So this is great. <laughs> <laughs> Don't we all? Uh so, uh, uh, so yes. let's, let's start with Winston here, our guest. Sure. Uh, yeah, I mean, <laughs> I think getting uh, uh, even further into the weeds, I think any <laughs> any moment where I could just realize that I experienced an alternate version or uh, interacted with an alternate version would scare the shit out of me, man. Mm-hmm. Like, that would, <laughs> yep. that would be uh, a terrifying... So all of it would be surprising. Sure. Um, and then on the flip of it, I think... At least me personally, I think I, I would go eat one of two ways, which, again, either just absolute fetal position fear um, <laughs> that uh, any choice had this kind of capability. But um, the other would just be absolute just apathy like this might as well happen. Like, because <laughs> I <laughs> for me personally, it just I, I've um I've had a lot of jobs. I've had a, like, I, I feel like the, the quote unquote, like alternate reality. And I think this happens with a lot of improvisers or just people in the entertainment industry. You kind of live in an alternate reality every, like every so while you're like, well, I guess I'm going to be a butcher today and yeah. I'll be that for a few months. We have and then... all had close to infinite jobs. Yeah. 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 So, yeah. so and, and with that comes its own logic and its own politics and its own. So like, if I saw a bunch of people that kind of look like me, that was like, yeah, that's my ID and I'm a bus driver. I'd be like, all right, yeah, good for you, bud. <laughs> yeah. That's really nice. But I think the, <laughs> the, the real answer, the real, real answer is probably um, I'd be surprised anybody who has a similar kind of personality makeup to mine and still like happy and excited and wanting like, like geared up <laughs> for stuff like, like, camp counselor kind of energy um with the <laughs> not i haven't had that tough a life i don't have that much you know <laughs> i don't have that much going on but i do think that uh anybody that isn't like at this point in my life it like uh walter mathow level grumpy um <laughs> would be like what happened man what what happened to you that didn't happen to me and why didn't it happen to me, man? Because you're doing well. 
I like there's this idea that it's like you walk into the situation thinking you're the ghost of Christmas past. Yeah. And then finding out you're Scrooge. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're like, oh, no, I'm the bad one. Wait, how did that happen? Yeah, yeah, yeah. (laughs) I'm just here to be an example for someone else to make better choices in their life. Yeah. This is terrible. I'm a cautionary tale as a human. My life, my existence is a cautionary tale (laughs) to somebody else. That's I do envision that. (laughs) Super. It is I, the ghost of your alternate self. I am here. Sorry, I had the AC on really high. Oh, yeah. Cold. Let me turn that off. Oh, thank you. (laughs) Oh, my gosh. How do you how do you how do you manage in here? It's like a meat locker. Uh, it's it's a meat locker. I am a butcher. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> foolish of me to not look around. I just apparated in here with you. Okay, all right. Uh, well, hello. Uh, I'm Jeremy. <laughs> what, Jeremy. Jeremy. Yes. Jer- is it, Jeremy like it starts with a G. Yes, that's right. Uh, like Jeff. All right, yeah. Well, all right. Yes. Whatever gets your. Uh, Apparates rishand. <laughs> uh, listen, let, let's let's just cut to the chase here. All right, shall we? <laughs> you, you, do you hear yourself? Uh, d- I'm yes. a butcher, and you say like, cut. Uh, anyways, go. Oh. Ahead. <laughs> all right, all right, gotcha, gotcha. All right, listen, uh, this isn't working. Any of this? Do you the, agree? The loins. I mean, your life, all of your choices, everything up to this point. Uh, I, I, <laughs> I think everything's going pretty great there, boss. Uh, really? I get to, I come into work six days a week. Uh-huh. Uh, I come, I, I work, I, I start very, very early in the morning. I'm off by like, by like 11 or noon and I got the uh-huh. whole rest of the day to do stuff. You know really? how many concerts I've seen at Jimmy Kimmel live? I, I don't, I, I don't, I don't, I don't track all the details. How many? Just ballpark me. Uh, like the I, Franks, ha ha! My turn. I got gotcha. you. Uh, <laughs> I get it. Uh, I'm just gonna keep cutting here. I, oh. My life's great. I, I got, really? Yeah, I got nothing. I got nothing to complain about. Uh, I don't have any responsibilities other than making sure this meat gets chopped, quartered, halved. Uh, really, however you want it. I, I I gotta say the meat looks great. I mean, you, you seem to take pride in your work here. I just. You know, it's it's my job to to show you uh, a better path. I, I get up uh, early every morning. I work all day, just popping into people's lives and showing them how they could improve their lives. It's it's what I do. It's it's kind of exhausting, but uh, it's it's why I'm here right now to to help you oh, get you on want, the right path. You want to go on a trip? Well, uh, yeah, I could take lunch. It's six a.m. <laughs> you 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 could you could just take off like that. I'm in a union. I get a I get a break. I'm, union. I'm a, I'm a human. Yeah. Oh my! Which we tried to unionize a long time ago. It's just, it's just, just they, the whole they shut us down. They gave everybody free pizzas and they did this whole presentation on why unions would ruin the entire oh, wait, thing. Everybody wait, wait, what is the spirit gonna do with pizza? <laughs> exactly. And yet it got everybody going. I don't know what it <laughs> is about free pizza. Welcome to the meeting. Oh. Can somebody please crank that heater up? Maybe a couple of degrees. Oh, I got you. I got you right here. Oh, uh, there you thanks. go. Oh, All right. my goodness. You know what? That's a bit too much. Can we? Can we? Happy medium. Happy medium here. All can right. we get? Sure. Oh. Man. There All you right. Go. All right. Just quit the yep. difference. Thank you very much. Welcome. 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 Uh, there's, there's 999 of you, but there's always room for one more. Am I right or am I right? <laughs> <That's>, yeah. <laughs> yeah, he's here. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. Good. Oh. All right. Welcome to Unions and Not You. <laughs> Welcome. Now, I, I hear uh, in this current branch of, <laughs> uh, I believe this is the... Uh, the scaring people on the street and narrow department is that is that correct? I've done so many of these. This is yeah, crazy. yeah. We do, we, yeah. we call we call them the scary narries. Uh, scary narry, yeah, perfect. Yeah. Thank you very much. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, you're going to be my top student here. I can already <laughs> tell. I can <laughs> already tell. <laughs> it's right. pretty great. Uh, and again, uh, just as a reminder. We did leave some frozen tombstone pizza in the back there for you. Um, you do whatever you like with it. 
we honestly don't know what to do with it ourselves. It's just kind of there. Uh, but in our lives, we kind of thought that about Tombstone as a whole. It just kind of was there, so we just kind of thought, you know, it was a fun little perk. This is the first compensation we ever gotten from this job. This is amazing. Perfect. We don't want Union. These guys are great. Whoa. And that's... Whoa. Oh, or is it Hold still too there. cold? Still too cold. Still no, too cold, I, bud. I was actually saying, <laughs> whoa, I'll, I'll in a little bit, bit of right. kind of astonishment and being no. a, a little scared oh, okay. from what my okay. colleague just Friend? You, we're just all friends said. here, so yeah. No, we, we do want unions. Pal. Yeah, that's right. I, I, I'm sorry. <laughs> the compliments kind of threw me off there for a minute, but yeah, I'm with my buddy here. The, the union is, is the plan. I, well, I... First off, first off, I don't like talking to anybody that I don't already know on a first name basis. So who do we got here? Who uh, am I talking to? I'm I'm Jeremy. I'm Jeremy. Jeremy. Is that Jeremy. with a G? Uh, yes. Like yeah. Jeremy? Like, like, like Germany yeah. without the the any? You got it. You got oh, it. Ah, perfect. Yeah. Perfect. Jeremy. Yeah. My number one guy. My number one dude. And who who's who's this friend that you're talking about that you, you feel so chummy but not enough to to maybe maybe know his name? Hmm? Oh, it's 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 uh, pestilence. Pest? What? Pestilence. We got, we got a we got an A-list celebrity here. We got one of the four horsemen of the apocalypse here. Oh, he gets that a lot, right? Yeah. Oh my goodness! <laughs> I I do I get that all the time, and that's just that was a that was a long time ago. Oh, yeah, it's, it's yeah. not. Well, you're still such such an infectious guest already right now. I love it. Ah, uh, well, perfect. boy, you you sh- oof, boo, hey. you you're you're a smooth hey. one there. You I'm just trying to... to connect person to person, like uh, all good executives should. And we don't need to unionize together. We're just one big happy family. I oh, don't understand. Oh, that yeah. means we are you saying we all unionize separately? Ooh, oh. you know, um. Uh, we tested separate but equal earlier in the <laughs> oh, in eternity, oh and it boy. didn't quite run yeah, as well no, as we would like. Uh, oh, okay. uh, ooh, ooh, indeed. Okay. We got a lot of oohs yeah. on that ooh, one. Okay. And, and I'll just yeah. say, my name's Pinkerton. I'm from another branch office, but I think I speak for all of us when I say we want the right to work. Am I right, guys? Yeah. Well, uh, we all do technically still yeah. have the right to work. See? We're good. Yeah. Who needs a union for that? Am Who I right? Who needs it, right? Uh, this guy oh, gets check out this Tombstone right. Pizza. I do, right. I do want the the right to work. I'm confused by the terminology here. Yeah. You have it. You have it. It's yours already okay. by default when you sign the contract. Oh, that's you great. have a right, right to work. You don't need to collectively bargain for the rights and needs of all of you. You just talk to me eventually on weekends unless I have my nephew out, and then definitely don't talk to me then. Wait, wait. Uh, speaking what? of me, who's, yes. What, what what was your name again? There, uh, my name hero? is uh, my name is um, eh, my name's unimportant. My name's uh, uh unimportant. That's unimportant. An one. I've never heard. Yeah, unimportant. It's unimportant. Is that, is that like just, a family name? A rep- is that no, 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 no. Did you read fine, that off fine. the side of a cereal box? Fine. Fine. fine, fine. I think I speak for all of us when I say that was very convincing. Yeah, thank you, thank you, Pinkerton. See this guy, I you know, uh, Jeremy. You're actually kind of being a little bit too much for questioning Quentin, which is something that we Whoa. definitely use all the time um, in Ugh. this industry. I, 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 I know Quint. He asks a lot of questions. Pest, Pesty just needs to. I, 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 I've been around the block yeah. a few times. Okay. Oh, well. I just before we go any further, it'd just mm. be really nice to know who who are you, but more importantly, who were you ah, before. Yes. You uh, took you're on this executive yes. level position. Yes. Of, you're absolutely of, right. Of, um, of telling spirits we can't do things together. You can do things. To- I never said you couldn't do things. You have a right to do things together. You just maybe, um, maybe individually come up with your queries and your and your complaints. You know what? I feel like my questions are passing right you're through right. you. You're right. Just you're like right. Walls. Like a, yeah, yeah, so, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so I'll level. I'll level. I'll level. I'll level. I um. Do you remember uh, a guy by the name of Zaslav? <laughs> I, I, I do. Uh, yeah, I'm his cousin. I gave him a lot of ideas I shouldn't have way, way, way back. And he's been just using... And frankly, I don't like treading on my family name, period. Because, like, come on. Uh, but uh, Wait a minute. Uh, are you saying, are you saying we're, oh, we are owned... Like, the spirit realm is now also part of the Warner Brothers Discovery family? I, uh, technically, you're a subsidiary of Max, I believe. Um, oh. But uh, 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 
like I said, I wouldn't put too much stock into that. Um, Pinker, did you got any other did, ideas? Well, but, but hold on a second. Do yeah. we get stock in Max? Because I, I would really love to, to pitch some ideas if I'm a shareholder. Do we at least get I a free I want, login? I want a fifth season of Westworld. You, I, I want a fifth season of Westworld. It's kind of all, expensive buddy. on um, its own. This is kind of... Already I mean, have so many streamers. Yeah. Hulu yeah. and Netflix yeah. and well, Peacock and Peacock. Crackle. Get rid of Peacock. It's got twisted Crackle. metal. Yeah. yeah. Uh, yeah. Spooper. Uh, you know. Scooper. There's a lot of them. And if, yeah. you know, I could save the money on HBO Max, that'd be great. No, not. Um, sorry. I Just a quick uh, little. Huh? little. T it's not HBO Max anymore, right? It's. Uh, um, Oh, uh, Max. Oh, that's right. You got rid of yeah. the only part people recognized. I forgot about that. Oh. Yeah. Was that, well, was that so right? I still he, have he to didn't. pay for HBO as well, then. His uh, cousin got rid of it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thanks, bud. Thank you so very much, Pestilence. And Good that, say, Pestilence. Not, not your that's bud. Not your thank bud. you. Thank you, buddy. That's, that's wow. really... You got a new buddy anyway, that quick, huh? Okay. Uh, right, union's bad. Uh... <laughs> I, I yeah. think he makes good yeah. sense, right, guys? Yeah, right? Somebody said that. Someone smart said that. I think yeah. Pestilence said that, actually. Oh, and have we mentioned this free pizza, by the way? Yeah! Oh, this is great! We also have uh, Hydrox in the back there. Those for you. <laughs> Originators, <laughs> oh, right? Wow. Yeah, those yes. the original Oreo knockoff people. Sandwich I think cookie. we got Pestilence yeah. here. I uh, didn't have lard in them. Food, they were all food makes short. me sick. Perfect. <laughs> yeah. I was going to say, we got pestles here, but no famine. Am I right, guys? Yeah, we got so yeah, much great yeah, food. Yeah. All feasts. That's right. I feel like I've been dazzled uh, to, to death here. I, I don't mm -hmm. even, I, I feel like, uh, I guess I'm going to vote against my own economic interests here and say no union. Ah, uh, yeah, no union. The pizzas did it. Boo. Hey, look, is Zaz Zaz your cousin, right? Right, yeah, yeah. Right, okay. Yeah, 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 Look, yeah, 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 I know yeah. I just came out of nowhere. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm I'm kind of gooey and drippy, and you might be feeling, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you might yeah, be feeling yeah. a little ill. Uh, yeah. Pestilence, one of the, just before you get there, yes, I was in the apocalypse. I rode mm -hmm. a horse. It's a whole thing. Uh, I just wanted to, I came back uh, because um, not too long from now, um, you're going to experience... Um, the end of your life and then you might find yourself uh suddenly getting a huge promotion that you don't really understand into some sort oh. of executive level position where uh you're gonna actually go into the spirit world and um uh try to to convince us not to unionize um oh. and i'm i i came back here to i'm um, see i'm part of the scary nares see we try to oh. Scare people in I've had a couple narrow, of you guys come and, by. Oh, you with have? Some very, yeah. A they, lot of ominous things, apparently, is going to happen in my life <laughs> right after I die. Uh, what? Yeah, a lot of scary, a lot of ominous, a lot no, of omen. I, I thought I was the first one coming back here. Because, yeah, but in, in the in the future, yeah. in, when you're, you see, you're, mm -hmm. I just came from a meeting where you were, you're dead, oh, you. And you future were, yeah, you, man, you were just feeding us some horse shit. You were just telling us, like, oh. union's bad. And, uh. Oh. Uh, we were also owned by Max at that point. Uh, um, wow. Yeah. That's oh, yeah. Yeah. Great idea. Actually. Yeah. To you, that's it's a... just HBO. But oh, yeah. yeah. Your, HBO your boy... and Cinemax, actually. So I think if we merge those two, we can get no, to No, maybe... uh, uh, this is not. Uh, no, mm. I am not trying to put mm. that idea in. No. No, this is great. <laughs> so I, I, uh, I think all in favor of the Pestilence uh, proposed idea to throw HBO out and just become Max? Aye. Oh, all right, uh, all opposed. Well, I mean, maybe, maybe we keep some anyone. aspects. I don't hear anyone. I can't hear you over the sound of that tube soap pizza. Okay, uh, I think I think that passes. Mm. I think that passes, guys. As, as long as the vote was democratic, I guess. Uh, all right. <laughs> well, now moving on to new business: chemical weapons. Are we in? Legit, 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 <laughs> legit. <laughs> oh, uh -huh. that went places. <laughs> Commentary. Am I right, fellas? Oh, uh, <laughs> Tombstone, the 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 frozen pizza brand with the best marketing, though, way back yeah. in the day. Yeah, oh, yes. yeah. Those those yeah, yeah. what do you want your Tombstone commercials? Grain in my memory. Actually, sure. I oh, think yeah. I have several of them in my freezer right now. Tombstone uh, commercials? 
Yes. Yes. Yeah. No, I, I keep them on ice just in case uh, we need to break them out again. You need the classics. I work in commercial preservation. Yes. Uh, it's yeah. a less it's yeah. a, it's a less sexy part of the film right. preservation world, but but still very important. Be- people don't know that the one inch tapes hold up better in the freezer. So yeah. Oh. Uh, that. Like I would say my very first job I had out of high school was it was like a summer job where I waited way too long to get a job. Uh, and there was like literally the only job I could find was a friend of mine was like, oh, uh, you know, my dad works at this company. Uh, he can get you a job. Like, Great. And so that job turned out to be working on the assembly line of a vegetable processing plant uh, in a right to work, no union uh, mm-hmm. state where... You know, like, you know, 425 an hour minimum wage, like 13 hour days. Um, and the good thing about that is every other job has been fine. Like, oh. if you get that one job that is the worst thing in the universe, then you will be able to soar at any other job, no matter what else you do. Uh, so I guess there's a I guess there's a me that stuck to that job. Yes. Uh, <laughs> who uh, like who was just. I, I would see and who would just say, look, can you just can you just kill me? Can, can you just, <laughs> just send you. I feel like it's going like to violate like, the space time continuum somehow. Like the nightmares you've described in the past where you fall into the machine and go oh, through yeah. the workings yeah. of it. Yes. Yes. The, that, that's the how modern times nightmares. Um, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, I, I guess like running into that me would be pretty terrifying. Like, you know, mm-hmm. like what happened at 18? Mm-hmm. Uh, like that was a job. There was a there was. My nickname at that job was the other white guy. There was a guy who was the white guy, Kevin. <laughs> Kevin was just there until his sentencing. Um, uh, but Kevin was also a neo-Nazi. Uh, ah, and he would stand next to I was going to ask for what, oh. but I don't want to know anymore. Yeah. yeah. Uh, it, 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 was whatever, it was whatever it was, plus assaulting a police officer. Mm. Um, uh-huh. Uh-huh. Which normally we're like, oh, it's kind of a bullshit charge. That, uh, right, exactly. Yeah. In this At case, that point, probably, I was trying to get hesitant. Yeah. <laughs> um, but uh, but yeah, but but he would like because I was the other white guy. He would like in what he thought was a whisper, uh, say like hyper racist oh, things to me, and I would be like, you know, like like, like standing next to a mob lawyer, going, right. "This man does not represent me." <laughs> um, <laughs> So to to me, the person who stayed there would be like, why did you give up that easily? Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Why was it, why did he feel the need to whisper it? <laughs> because he was with people like that, right? He yeah. was severely outnumbered. Uh, <laughs> okay. Like he had enough fingers to count and tell that he was outgunned. And if there's one thing neo-Nazis know, it's that you can only win a fight when there are 40 more of you than the person you're fighting. Yeah. That's true. Uh, yes. Like yeah. it's the only place where their math skills really kick in. <laughs> yeah, because um, I was going to say I'm kind of impressed with his uh, his ability to to recognize that because it sure seems like there's a lot of people in society right now who don't recognize when to keep their mouths shut. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, and also don't recognize that they shouldn't be neo Nazis. <laughs> right, uh, right. Yes. Well, that, one that step at a time. One step right. at a time. Yeah. Right. Yeah. 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 I'm sure he is the senator from South Carolina at this point. So, yeah, Uh, Yeah, math is the gateway drug to not being a neo-Nazi. Yeah, 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 exactly. Uh, Kevin Lindsey Graham. Um, (laughs) (laughs) It's so cute how they like they they make themselves feel better or justify it by calling themselves Mm. neo-Nazis (laughs) because. You're yeah, just the, Nazis. the the second half of that word is so gauche. Um, <laughs> <laughs> you really gotta zhuzh it up a little bit. Now, now post nineties, did that become like a Nazi who could then like see through Mein Kampf uh, and then uh, manipulate yes. the code? Yes, <laughs> yes. Some of some of them don't even see the code. They just see right, a, yeah. a blonde person with blue yes. eyes and a blonde person with blue eyes and a blonde <laughs> person with blue eyes. I'm not. Um, I'm not saying we couldn't make the Hatrix. I'm just saying that it would sell immediately. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> Zaslav is already working on it. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that's the next one. That's his superpowers. You mentioned something. He's already working on it. <laughs> I love how all of our cast members have committed to not being on Max shows. Oh, <laughs> all right. Gross. Uh, who, who I suppose is- that would be the yeah. uh, version of me that would Ooh. surprise me the most is like the, the being the Zaslav. Most, the, uh, 
<laughs> no, that would be your daddy's ass lap. Huh? That would be dope <laughs> if I if I was if I uh-huh. was paid two hundred fifty million dollars a year to <laughs> to fucking jack off. In a in an opulent office, that would be dope. Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, the 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 version was the dream, I'm... right? <laughs> I mean, Is that kind the job of. description. I, what yeah. <laughs> right now, I'm just getting minimum wage to you do know, that at a bus station. I'm only two hundred forty nine million nine hundred ninety nine thousand nine hundred ninety nine dollars away from that dream. <laughs> I've I, well, I've never jacked off in any office, but I imagine if I did. It would be the best in the most expensive office. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. yeah that's right. the privilege you're, 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 uh, I was going to say buying, but getting paid for. Absolutely. I mean, I've, I was I'm more, more meant at metaphorically jacking off, but sure, mm. he probably is. <laughs> we know, we know it's not just metaphorical in yeah. this bubble. <laughs> it's super. Just give me a minute, okay? Just give me one minute. That's, that's all I ask. You can hear a pin drop in here. Just. Cool it. Would you okay? would you like me to avert my eyes or no? Nope. Just take a step back. Okay. And cool it. That's all. That's all I need. That's all I'm going for. I've got. Sir, no time few... to knock or see if anything. Oh my oh, goodness! Hey, whoa! Hey! Yeah, hey! Yeah, hey! Same hey. mistake I made. <laughs> hey! Hey guys! Uh, first off, saying knock is not the same as knocking. I, I just well, want to I, I said no time to knock, so I. Yeah, what, yeah, well, yeah, fair enough. what do you mean I, no time? You you've got no time. What what's going I, on? I feel like no it'd be better if knock. I can look at you and see your lips. While, oh now, gosh, damn it! No, just oh. eye contact. I we're we're, we're come yeah, on, guys. No, I've I've, I've turned around. Three. I don't need to. I've kept the we're adults eye contact here. here yes. All right. I am an audio visual learner. I have to look at a man in the eyes when I so I can understand what's coming out of his mouth and. Oh God! Oh come I on! Sorry, I have. I, I said you... one minute. I said just give me one minute to this guy, and then Fredrickson, what's going on? What do you need? That's so important that you couldn't even do the one thing. You see that little post-it that's right on the other door? It's knock. That's all you gotta do, and then this wouldn't have been a problem. I, I thought that was the name of a new project. Well, it, it's yes and anyway, Fredrickson, what, what what's up? <laughs> all right, yeah, no, Mister Busy gets it's, to go ahead yeah. of me. All right, that's hey. fine. No Are you making knock. 17 figures for doing this, huh? I get, my time is money here. I don't uh, even know what 17 figures is. Exactly. exactly. Sir, exactly. I, I just, what do we got? Um All right, I'm going to I'm going to power through this. Yeah. Looking at your eyes. Uh hey. the, I just want to let you know that the new office doorbells came in. The clappers? Yeah. <laughs> the ones that so instead of knocking, we can just, you know, yeah, yeah, hit yeah. the doorbell for each individual office to well, let you well, know hold, we wanted to come in. Hold on, Fredrickson, that's what I came here to tell him. You're going to, you're going to jump in front of me and hey. steal my thunder on, on, on the doorbells. I, what the are you? hell? Are you going to do that, Fredrickson? You, are you going to yeah, let that happen, Yeah, you know what? I'm going to do that. I'm going to. All right. Yep. You get a raise, Fredrickson. Good for you. That's initiative. <gasps> what? That's fantastic. That's what great. The- Oh, sorry, your, your you. daughter is here for your God lunch appointment. damn it. All right. All right. This is my 12 o'clock is shot. All right. Let's get. All right. I'm pulling them up. Let's. All right. Uh, Let's well, it. I don't think you've actually quite shot yet. So. Yeah. I was going uh, well, right. to point that out. Fredrickson. Oh well, Fredrickson, God. thank you. Thank you for the observation. Another raise, buddy. Oh, my 850. God. Yes. That's on you. Yes. That's what I like to see. Perfect. <sighs> Now, if you don't mind, I gotta, I gotta pull up. I gotta get going. All right. Please, please, sir. All please, right. do whatever you, uh, uh, whatever you wish. Oh my God! Oh. I, I, all the space, all the respect, sir. I, do you want me to bring Thank your you. daughter in, or? Do... Eventual? Not now. What? No. Not now. No. I gotta. No. Not, I, no. I don't uh, want to do that. Uh, no. I, I believe he'd like to. I believe he'd like to finish. Yeah. Well. <laughs> I wouldn't sir, put too sir, fine a point on that. The Make a Wish Foundation are here to. God <laughs> damn it! You can Stas- hear them, sir. You can hear I, how excited they are. I, I, I am just so blocked up th- today. I just can't believe it. Um, um wait, sir, you know, would you like me to? Would you like me to cancel your afternoon? Yeah, just clear it all out. <laughs> I just have one wish. Just give me a minute, okay? Just one I, goddamn minute. I just always one solitary. See, I'm uh, alone finally. Just God al- damn it! Always wanted to see a corporate video conferencing system. Yeah. Well, <laughs> all right. I don't have much time. Okay. I, 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 the doctor right. says that I only have another thirty-five seconds to live. You and me both, bud. Anyway, 
Um, <laughs> what, uh, what, what would, yeah, uh, if you could just really get to the end, get to that sentence. Like it's, we're down to about 20 now. Oh, sorry. Um, uh, I make a lot of money. Is that good? <laughs> yes. I, no, the corporate video conferencing system was. The, sorry, I, um, you're standing use, in front of the corporate video conferencing yeah, system. It's that Zoom. Was all I ever wanted it's, to see. It's Zoom. You hit play, and uh, you uh, hit play on a video conferencing system. Yeah. Uh, well, I'm sure that's not a DVD player. Frederickson, or get Frederickson in. What's I, going? On? I'm I'm dying here. Dude, I'm just, dying I'm in this kid's arms tonight. tonight. Sorry, sir. Uh, just got to get my pants on. Um, oh, you. Thank you. <laughs> This kid's on track to be an executive by tomorrow. Uh, this is oh, perfect. This kid, sir, this kid is dead. No, you, Fredrickson, <laughs> you were the genius. This kid's oh, dead. Oh, thank this you. This kid's dead. <laughs> he is. What did you need me for, sir? Nothing now. It's oh. perfect. <laughs> we're fine right. now. Would you? Uh, so, sir, do you want something done with the body, or do you, do you just uh, want it left here? What uh, the fuck? Who comes swooping in now yeah, to take this out from under me? Come on. Whoa. Fredrickson, I'm trying to get, get this guy out of here along with the body. This guy's just a vulture. Thank I can't you, sir. Thank it. you for recognizing <laughs> my professionalism. It. But I this thought I had the right to work here. Ridiculous. You, <laughs> you do, and you have the you right what, to put that body ice, buddy. on your shoulders and carry it out for me. You you go ahead, I'll follow. Oh, so, sir, sir, your mistress is here for your one o'clock. <laughs> Finally, I'm dressed appropriately. Uh, <laughs> Legit. Legit. <All> right. <laughs> Oh, it is that kind of a show, apparently. <laughs> uh, speaking of the kind of show this is, it's yes. also a show that is uh, paid for by sponsors. It definitely Who's is. Who's our sponsor this week, Michael Hyman? Oh, I've got it right here, Jet. Don't you worry. Oh, my bad. Jillian's name was right there. I'm a dick. <laughs> <laughs> my bad. Anyway. <laughs> Come on down to beautiful Beverly Hills suburb in Los Angeles, California, and witness the only publicly available green space where you will not be fined for having a low income to visit, Beverly's Hill. Seen in the historic Beverly Hills area, Beverly's Hill is a lumpy, steep, semi-exclusive, naturally occurring, um, mountain-like hill thing for you to visit and look at. Come bask in the splendor of Beverly's Hill, Beverly Hills Hill. So you can see all the beautiful people's lives from a place where we know where you are and stay. So we know when you're present and don't get surprised when you're walking down Rodeo Drive. They say, oh, a poor. Come to Beverly's Hill. Bette Midler approves of its natural construction and sing songs from afar. You will not be allowed close to Bette Midler. She lives in a gated community. Beverly's Hill is ungated, and it will be the only ungated hill you encounter in Beverly Hills when you arrive at Beverly's Hill. Say hi to Beverly while you're there. <laughs> I gotta say, yeah. not, like I would pay Four thousand dollars a month to live in a studio uh, apartment. There, that sounds, yeah. that sounds pretty yeah. amazing. That's yeah, about what it costs. Yeah, yes. absolutely. Yeah, yeah. The, and the studio apartment, if I understand correctly, is a a bunker in the hill with no windows. Yes, uh, yeah. which is a steal, honestly, in in, right. in Los Angeles. Yeah, uh, it's, it's bunker is hill. The kitchen in the Chipotle where you <laughs> <Right>. work. <laughs> yes, yes. The short-lived series they made there, Beverly's Hill Cop. Uh, was not as successful. Um, it's a very small jurisdiction. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> Eddie Murray stars in it. It's uh, <laughs> not not quite as not quite as successful, but uh, yeah, but, it's yeah. it's also it's it's awkward because he just plants evidence all the time in it, and it's like, am I supposed to root for this guy? What's what's the deal? Uh, also, yeah. weird eighties homophobic stereotypes about. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> well, but this see now we're we're talking about the alternate reality. Oh. One, of, one of the alternate yep. realities where it's Beverly's Hill mm -hmm. and the big star was Eddie Murray. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> but there probably weren't, there, in that world, there weren't uh, ridiculous homophobic 80s stereotypes. Oh. The 80s was a, was a decade of, <laughs> was a prosperous decade yeah. uh, full of growth and, and social acceptance. And, uh, I, yeah. I like this alternate reality. <laughs> yeah. This wow. is what happens when Dukakis won. This is, <laughs> is it is it too late to get on that train? Uh, the car my parents had, uh, the, like the the car I learned to drive in, 
was like the uh, it, it was like a the political graveyard of the 1980s. So it had three. It was like uh, a, a Carter Mondale uh, 80 mm-hmm. bumper sticker next to a Mondale Ferraro uh, next to a Dukakis Benson bumper sticker. <laughs> wow. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it was, and it was in South Carolina too. So it was, uh, so it was ne- next to an egg that was thrown on it. It <laughs> feels like it feels like uh, like that, like the the eighties, nineties, even early two thousands was an alternate reality mm. politically to what like how how fucking crazy far it's gone now. Where like yeah, a dude, a dude's entire political career ended because he misspelled potato right <laughs> right right and yeah. it, like take me back true. please take yeah. me back please yeah. yeah i want to live in that moment the rest of my life <laughs> or or how, how about the guy whose presidential bid ended because he shouted too enthusiastically yeah yeah <laughs> Yeah. yeah. Wait, who who was that? Who's that? Howard, Howard Dean. Howard Dean, right. He was like, Woo! Ah! Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, exactly. Like, Those were two conference, he was fantastic just, like, impressions at the yeah, same time. exactly, <laughs> yes. He was just really excited about something, and people were like, that guy's a little creepily excited. Right, yeah. Guess we won't vote for him. Yeah. Yeah, that, that guy seems like he believes in what he's saying too much. <laughs> right. uh, but boy, could he dance. Oh, he could man. just cut a rug. Nobody knew that at the time, but you know. Speaking of which, there's there's actually that there's my answer. I feel like I would be most shocked to find an alternate reality where I am a professional dancer. Uh, oh. I have I am just I am not a coordinated person. I am not comfortable dancing. I am extreme. Like this, this is one of the things that I find funny about being a performer is I'm also incredibly self conscious. Uh, so there are there are certain the things like I, I, yeah, exactly right, yeah. <laughs> Uh, there are there are things where I just I cannot do them because I'm constantly sure people are laughing at or at least looking at and judging me. Um, and and dancing has always been one of those things where it's like, can't do this well, not going to give people the fodder to make fun of me for it. So I will just not dance. Uh, I did. There was yeah. a summer arts program I did in high school. Uh, and like one of the like it was a like it's like kids from all over the state came and you live there for like six weeks and you did like, I was in the theater program, but there was a dance component to it. And at the end of it, you got an evaluation. Oh boy. Uh, no. And mine said, nice attempt at dance. <laughs> 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 it's like, okay. I, you know, a, like a simple zero would have sufficed. Right. Uh, right. Yeah. Yeah. That, that would somehow be less, less patronizing. Yeah. But, but it made, made it clear which direction I should take, which was yeah, away yeah. from them. Yeah. No, I, I, I love music. You know, I really appreciate it, but I have no mis- musical abilities. Um, and it's, it's funny because my wife was really surprised when we have taken some dance lessons. Cause we did for, we did take swing lessons for our wedding and whatnot. And I wasn't utterly incapable of picking up the techniques and everything. And th- the biggest thing she was shocked at is I have rhythm. She said mm. she, she's always known anybody who says they can't dance, have no sense of rhythm. I have a really good sense of rhythm. Like I can follow it really well. My my father was a professional drummer, and I guess that carried over or whatever. Like I can follow rhythm no problem. I appreciate music. I can track the patterns in it in various ways and so on. But I couldn't for the life of me attempt to create any kind of music i don't play any instruments whatsoever uh i think some of it just comes down to i don't you know adhd doesn't let me learn stuff like that surprise having a father who's a musician that you didn't end up picking something up through your child but i guess you're too busy being a star <laughs> that's right that's right <laughs> yes yes i was too busy uh with the other thing i'd be surprised at being a successful actor well and that's the flip of the coin right because yeah. it's it's not so much because getting back into the weeds of things yeah. um I'd be shocked. I would like to be, I'm curious. I'm more curious what the alternate version would be surprised of, of me than I of the other person. Oh, mm. I like, like that. What did That's they find? That was like, yeah. Hey, what happened to you? Right. Yeah, <laughs> true. We're cause... over here. We're all being fishermen. Ugh. What happened to you, buddy? Right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You when we book. got, when we got lost in the, in the jizz, uh, a mm. little bit ago, <laughs> the, um, the, uh, the Star I, Wars cantina music, the not yet jizzing. Yeah. yeah. Uh, yeah. I, yeah. I was going towards, I would be surprised that the alternate version of myself that was like the, the craziest bigot. Um, oh, yeah. 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 Right. But oh, that, point, yeah. that version of myself would be equally as surprised at like, how could I ever possibly accept someone that's be different so than woke. me? Yeah. yeah. 
Yeah. Although knowing yeah. this alternate, it would probably be an even dumber description. Like, oh, you're learned. <laughs> please <laughs> please not I see the alternate version of myself being like wait you haven't done anything with your life yet what the fuck are you doing what, right. why are you, are you, where's your kids where's your wife what's going on here well that's just my family that I don't have to go far, very far for that <laughs> I don't have to see another alternate that's good yeah, that, that's technically an alternate version of yeah <laughs> um, I have a more successful sibling. Does that count? Um, yeah. Well. Uh, uh, no, but like actually, like I've uh, I have a eight year old daughter, and like they're doing like college, like looking at like researching colleges in class. It's really just like at eight. It, well, it's <laughs> it's really just like building like the idea of mm. like mm. you know aspiration for college. Mm-hmm. But like part like of it starting is your admissions letter. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Um, <laughs> Definitely uh, getting those get, extracurriculars get your, in order. <laughs> yeah. Um, but like part of it is like career research. And I think of like there were people I knew who like knew what they wanted to be when they were like seven years old and then studied to be that and became that and are that. Uh, and I think that would be like like a version of me that like had a goal and stuck with it versus like ate the Whitman sampler of employment uh, (laughs) temping through the 90s and 2000s. I mean, yeah, I guess that's what, like, the most elite, like, uh, athletes are, right? They, uh, well, I don't know that they necessarily know at three years old that they want to be a a world-renowned pole vaulter, uh, but... But their dad does. Yeah. (laughs) Yeah. 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 Yeah, it's super... At this point in the recording process, a guest who will remain unnamed to protect them from persecution ran out of disk space. The rest of the episode will be edited from a merged backup track using a method that's technically called, fuck it, we could still make this work. We thank you for your understanding. Oh, please have a seat. Uh, the, the crowd here is, is, is looking forward to, to meeting you. Uh, uh, well, I'm not sure I need to give much of an introduction, but uh, uh, Jonathan here is, uh, is a... Uh, well, let me let me list this out here. A basketball ninja robot warrior. Boy, uh, Jonathan, That's uh, my boy. That's Jonathan, my boy. please uh, yeah, tell us. Uh, take some cards. You, uh, you you started on this career path uh, young, did you not? That's my boy over there. He's a ninja and a basketball star. <laughs> oh, you seem so so shy, Jonathan. Uh, please, just uh, are, are you allowed to speak? I don't know. If, does the ninja part not let you talk? Or I, I don't understand. Or as a Use robot, those perhaps. Those lips, buddy. You got it. Just do it. You're the best. Actually, oh, I'm right behind you. Oh, jeez. Wow. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Was that was that a, a decoy sitting in the seat in front of me? Occupational hazard. <laughs> oh, this is amazing! Oh my gosh, it's just uh, it's, it's an honor to meet you. I just we we want we want to know everything about you. Well, I uh, I'm a basketball star. Mm-hmm. That's my position. Yes. yes. Hey, uh, and uh, I am a ninja warrior, uh-huh. sort of a warrior who works in silence and darkness, uh, right. uses various kind of martial arts techniques filtered through a sort of like a white Western view that sort of takes all Asian cultures and merges them into this one thing. Yeah, uh, about but, the but like that in a tell good way. About the stars. You throw stars. Oh, and, and I throw metal stars that, yeah. uh, that stick into things. Uh, we all I love have, the stars. We all love the stars. Yes, uh, yes. Uh, nunchaku, you probably call them nunchucks. Uh, <laughs> I do, uh, guilty, yep. guilty. Yep. yep. So yep. that, and I am, uh, don't want to toot my own horn, but I am the first police astronaut. Oh, this is news. Yep. Oh, I thought you were going to get into the whole robot thing, but uh, oh, police astronaut, uh, well, when did this start? Well, I, I, I was working as a robot, and they said, <laughs> with your complete lack of emotion and empathy, Mm. Uh, you could work in law enforcement. So uh, they said, you know what, terrestrial law enforcement for someone who's as tall as you are, a basketball star, who you're probably too tall to enforce the laws here on Earth. So Standard, have you yeah. considered space law enforcement? Uh, and I said, bleep, bloop, bleep, bloop. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, let's do it. That's my boy. Inspiring. 
inspiring. How did you how did you stay on track through through your life to to reach this point? I mean, you 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 started early in this plan, right? Yeah, I, I started when I was uh, oh geez, that must have been like maybe maybe five years old. Wow. Uh, and wow. I uh, I I saw a basketball game mm-hmm. with my dad, and yeah. then uh, it ended. And then after that, the movie American Ninja uh, came on. Uh, and then after that was a uh, commercial for a toy robot that when you press the button at the top, it said, I am the atomic powered robot. Please give my good wishes to everybody. And at that point I said, you know what? I have my trick. And here I am today, smoke bomb. I'm not going to leave, though. I'm, I'm still here. <laughs> oh, uh, okay. Uh, I was expecting you to just be gone. <laughs> uh, see, that's we ninjas. We've got we a lot don't more do time. what you expect. <laughs> All right. Nobody move. This is a stick-up. We hear the mayor's daughter is in attendance. Grab her, Chuck. We're going to take the mayor's daughter and everybody's jewelry, and then we're heading to space. And that's nobody right. the can stop coming us. With us. So I, I can't do anything to stop him right now, but once they get to space... I, then it's my jurisdiction. Right now, have you ever seen like a Dukes of Hazard episode where they stop at the county line? Like that's yeah, that's kind of yeah, where I am. absolutely I understand. Oh yeah, that's a good that's a uh, yeah, that's yeah. mostly episodes. Yeah, I I, I watched that one with my dad too, but did, fortunately did not set it as a uh, outbreak. Well, get get just, over just, here, Bear's daughter. Yeah, shut up. It, you get over here. Come yeah, with us. Can oh, you wait right. for this to play itself out? That, that that's how it works. We just wait. I don't know. I, I'm at your sidekick at this point. I feel like I, I'm just automatically your sidekick because I'm here with you. Because you're standing next to me. Right. Right. Yeah. Is that how how it works? Is yeah, that how yeah, the one I, gets chosen? Wallets in the bag. Watches. Pearl necklaces. Oh, that looks like a nice necklace. Yeah, I, I would love to get involved, but uh, but as a uh, police officer, we actually do have a very strong union. Uh, and so we have some really strong union rules we need to abide by. Uh, and I can't be taking awesome. jobs from two rest free of police officers. So, right, but right. you get to space, buddy. I got you. Smoke you go. bomb. Still Man, here. Can I, borrow, can I borrow that purse? We're kind of running out of bag space. Yeah, yeah, no, I'll get the purse back to you. I'll just keep everything. Oh, thank, thank you. This is not good. Right. Get that jewelry in this bag. <laughs> crap, crap, this is, crap, a, crap. This is a, a rather long holdup, honestly. I feel like, especially if you're gonna kidnap a uh, mayor's daughter, you should probably just. We're kidnap pressing our luck because no one's stopping us. <laughs> also, the, it, it takes a while for the for the shuttle to, to warm up its engines. We have we, we have to escape the Earth's gravity. Uh huh. Okay. So, hey, maybe, maybe you want to interview us about that. That sounds pretty interesting. Uh-huh. Yeah, huh? yeah. Space, space criminals? Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm space I'm, bandits. I'm, you know? Do you mind? Do you mind, I, Jonathan? I'm willing to move down on the couch and provide color commentary the occasional laugh. Great. All right, scoot over. That's my right. son being supported. Okay, so uh, why don't you uh, tell me tell me about yourself? Uh, what do we call you? Uh, oh, man, I didn't. I wasn't ready for this. Uh, uh, space... Tell him, Gus. Uh, Gus. Uh, all right, Gus. Oh, I shouldn't spend all day jacking off in my office. That's um, my criminal partner right there. Oh, uh, uh, yeah. Uh, we're the Space Jacks. I'm I'm so sorry, Gus. Is this a good good time? Is a bad time? I just came in. <laughs> Damn so it! Sorry. I just want. I just need one oh, minute. I'm just oh, trying to oh, plan oh, our next uh, heist, and I yeah. need oh, just oh, need, need one. All what? the clothes on. And you did that, or just kind of some. When what's your no, plan I, on the plant? You know what I mean. Like this is kind of open. Yeah. Yeah. I, yeah. My plan. I. It's really hard to focus if I don't. Um. If I get, don't get to the shooting range. Oh. Hmm. Right. Hey, I'm hey, it's, uh, it's my first day here. It's my first day. Uh, I just want to rush in here, get you, see if you need anything. You need coffee? Oh my gosh. Yeah, oh, this, is... this seems familiar. Uh, it's... Wait, you've done this before? What? Oh boy, I, yes. This is my first time. This no, is wild. Uh, this I think is I know how to handle this, uh, okay. sir. Uh, 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 oh gosh, uh, uh, the doorbells arrived. Oh. That's what I was gonna say. What the hell, man? <laughs> oh, <laughs> well, you looks it. like, cool yeah, thing. you're you are really getting lazy, aren't you? And look, our new intern <laughs> doing pretty well. You know, he came from the corporate world. I did, he, I did. Yeah, uh, he Gus, knows, he Gus, uh, the Big Wish yeah. children are here. Oh. Perfect. Wow. Okay. You know what? I can advise you on this one, sir. Just act fast. They don't have their expiration date is real quick on these. Oh, we, well, you know what? Uh, uh, I'm a, I'm a, I, I always have time for children. So, uh, you know That's what? That's great because they don't have much. My personal time can, can, can wait for another time. I'm fine with that. <laughs> wow. Uh, much better boss than my last one. Oh, my God. This is amazing. 
Yeah. Um, I love you already. This is be- this is a step up from where you came from? This <laughs> we is are, we are we no are idea. still waiting. We are still waiting. <laughs> yeah, do no, you, no, no, send him in. Do you do profit thing sharing, by the a way? A lot of here? these, a lot of, oh, yeah, absolutely. Anything <gasps> we anything we steal uh, is split evenly between uh, all the employees. I get a slightly bigger. Um, I found you, you my know, new home. Cut, well, size but, doesn't matter about that. I think we all kind of I, have a it, Again, it still waiting. Size again, it's still waiting. It is what just, you, just, it's what you do waiting. with the yeah, funds that you exactly. get of from course. the heist. I invest. But since I do the planning of the heist. But just so you know, um, oh, well. Yeah, this one died. Could you send in the next one uh, while I finish? Yes, this sir. Up? Yeah, why uh, don't you why don't you get rid of this one? Get rid of this one. Yeah, I, take I, take I, it out. I'll, I'll do yes. this. Thank I'll, you. I'll right. do this okay. one intern, and then you can take the rest right, because you're the intern. You don't tell me. Yeah, uh, we might we of... might be telling what? you what to do. What? We might. Be... I kind of I kind of feel yeah. like I am. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Let's uh, let's get some fresh uh, some fresh kids in here. All right. Okay. Uh, yeah, well, I, I, all pick right. pick a pinker one. So uh, one will, uh, do any of them want to go to space? Because that is where we uh, you know do Ooh. commit a lot of our crimes. Let me. Uh, I got so, the list right here. Oh, wow, three of them picked space as their wish. Normally we can't wow. grant that one, hey, but uh, we could we could kill a couple, make a wish children with the same <laughs> wish. That's a common phrase it that is, we're going to use here it is. from yeah. now on. Yes, uh, it's a kid in the hand, right? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> the <Jeff. laughs> That is a phrasing in this scene that is very not kosher. <laughs> I was lucky to have died early in that scene. Uh, <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> oh, you'll be extra sorry when you find out that that's the line that ends this episode. <laughs> Always gonna go out on top. <laughs> so, is there an alternate reality where I did a different episode? Uh, <laughs> oh, Michael Hyman, why don't you say the things you say? Thank you, as always, to Matt Walker for our intro and outro music. This episode was hosted by Jet Kaufman, edited by Jet Kaufman, Chris Sanders, and hosted by me, Michael Hyman. Every scene you heard today was improvised on the spot, along with some of the ads with only a light touch of editing for your comfort. If you're loving what we're doing, pause real quick and write a five-star review before you close the app and tell your friends about us. Tonight's regular cast included Chris Sanders and Chris Compton, and that's Woo. it. And our very <laughs> special guest, Winston Andrews. <laughs> uh, Winston, do you have anything uh, to plug, to share? You want people to follow you and find you and find stuff you do? You can definitely follow me on... Uh, all. I don't, I'm no longer on Twitter, but uh, that's, I think, for the best. Um, but you can... Uh, follow me, yeah, Winston Andrews, uh, or uh, Spec Script Improv. Um, I think we still have an Instagram page, but uh, uh, yeah. Uh, we'll post link, much links up. in the show notes. Please. Absolutely. Oh, oh, actually, I do have one thing. Yes. Um, uh, yeah. While I, I didn't really quite touch on this, but I do have um, a museum exhibition that I uh, helped build over the oh, lockdown. Wow. Uh, Very it's cool. cool. Yeah, it's a really cool exhibition on um, the this. It's a very cool exhibition on a very uncool subject, but actually, it's kind of cool too. Oh, but it's the best a, kind. yeah, it's a, a museum exhibition on how uh, comic books were kind of an integral part of the uh, Japanese American internment uh, experience. Oh, wow, okay, and, and kind of how uh, yeah, it's called images and imaginings of camp, uh, and it's it's. All online. I I got a lot of help with uh, Chapman University, so you can. I think you can still search for it there, but I, I definitely have a link that I can show yeah. in the notes. Yeah, we'll, um, we'll, we'll oh, definitely, wow. definitely put the link in the show notes. Yeah, it does it, sound actually really cool. Yeah, it it was it was pretty cool. We had a, a physical exhibition for uh, about a year, and now it's just oh, a wow. digital, but it's still all there, and it's it's ready for you to see. That cool. is fascinating. Great. All right. Thank, thank you for putting that work together because that sounds amazing. All right. Well, uh, we'll definitely link to that. All right. Well, thank you all for joining me for another episode of the Super Legit Podcast. This was fun. We'll, uh, we'll see you all on the next one. <laughs> There's yeah. no Josh here to do his thing. And There's I, no. Just, yeah. We don't just, have a could, bit. Can I just get one minute? Just, just <laughs> one minute. <laughs> I don't believe. Anything's on Oh my time I kick the door On its hinges Just so I could move on
uh, what, uh, very realistic uh, corporate union presentation. Hey, <laughs> I've been in enough of them. Documentary. Yeah. 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 yeah.